Well, I'm calling today a sunshine bonus as you look at the blue sky over uh, Hazeldale out of my place. Camera's being kind of funky. There you see Concerto K laying down, kind of washed out. Sorry about that. All right, here's what's happening. Um, inversion temperature forecasting, this pattern that we are in, is an absolute nightmare for forecasters because the air mass is inherently warm. Let me give you an example. If this were summer or there was no inversion in place, the natural temperature that we would want to be would be 66 degrees. So again, this air mass is really warm, but here it is winter. We start off with an inversion, warmer up top, cold at the bottom. Takes it a little while to get going, but with the sun pretty much all day today, we have warmed into the mid to even in some spots, upper 40s uh, across the area. So, great day, hope you enjoyed it. Now overnight tonight, temperatures are gonna cool again. The dew point tonight is 25 if the charts are correct. So if we get back down to the mid to upper 20s tonight, then we will start to see developing fog again. Here's the catch. The inversion tomorrow looks to be stronger than it was today, stronger than it was yesterday. Which means if we would see widespread fog develop tonight, which we may or we may not, but if we do, it would be that much more likely that the low fog would get trapped and we would have a Friday that would struggle to break out of the clouds. And if that's the case, we're back down only to around 38 or 40 for high. But if we don't have fog develop tonight, if there's enough of a breeze around, then tomorrow will be like today, easily up into the mid 40s, maybe warmer, beautiful sunshine. Now this inversion pattern will break this weekend and we'll get back to more normal conditions and eventually get back into the chance of rain. All right, for now, that is the forecast. Enjoy what should be a very nice but cool evening and I will talk to you soon.